A blessed morning to everyone. I am Dr. Maria Teresa Garcia, an instructor of the Elocusor Polytechnic State College. I am honored to present to you my study entitled Strategic Intervention Material to Improve the Performance of the College Freshman Students. Mathematics in the modern world is one of the eight courses added to general education subjects taught in the new college curriculum. In this study, the Mathematics in the Modern World performance of the college sophomore students of the Ilocosur Polytechnic State College, Santa Maria Campus was assessed, which led to the formulation of a strategic intervention material. This study assessed the performance of the college sophomore students of the Ilocosur Polytechnic State College for the first semester school year 2020-2021 along the course Mathematics in the Modern World, which led to the formulation of a strategic intervention material. Specifically, it answered the following questions. What is the level of performance of the respondents in Mathematics in the Modern World along patterns and numbers in nature and the world, mathematical language and symbols, problem solving and reasoning, and data management? Second, what is the level of difficulty on the various topics covered in mathematics in the modern world? The methodology. Research design. This study made use of the descriptive research design employing the developmental approach. So the developmental design was used in the formulation of the strategic intervention material. The respondents of this study are the second year college of the Locosur Polytechnic State College, Santa Maria Campus, for the school year 2020-2021. They are the second batch of the newest general education subject in mathematics in the modern world. The researcher made use of the Slobin's formula to determine the sample size and the random sampling techniques in determining the samples. The table shows the population and the number of samples taken from each college. So from the College of Computing Studies, 89, from the College of Teacher Education, 28, College of Business Management and Entrepreneurship, 98, and from the College of Agriculture, Forestry, Engineering, and Development Communication, 39 with a total of 254 respondents. The researcher used a survey questionnaire to assess the level of performance in mathematics in the modern world of the student respondents. It is a 40-item teacher-constructed multiple-choice test. The items were equally divided from the four main topics in mathematics in the modern world covered for the whole semester. Items 1 to 10 were taken from the topic patterns and numbers in nature and the world. Items 11 to 20 were taken from the mathematical language and symbols. Items 21 to 30 from problem solving and reasoning, and items 31 to 40 were from the topic data management. The pilot testing was done at ISPS Santiago Campus, which had a reliability score of 0.75 using the Cronbox Alpha. It was validated by five mathematics in the modern world instructors. The computed mean value of 4.4 revealed that the validity of the questionnaire is very high. Upon approval of requests from the Office of the President and College Deans, the researcher floated the questionnaire to the respondents through Google Form. 100% of the questionnaire were collected and the res responses were tallied and submitted for statistical treatment. The statistical package for social science was utilized. Specifically, the mean was utilized to describe the mathematical performance of the students and the level of the validity of the strategic intervention material. Whereas the difficulty index formula was used to determine the difficulty index of the test items. So the following are the results of the study. The table shows the level of performance of the respondents in the mathematics in the modern world. So along patterns and numbers in nature and the world, 
it has a computed mean of 6.55 described as very satisfactory so the findings of this study conforms with the result of the study of Roman and Villanueva that patterns and numbers in nature and the world cut the highest mean while mathematical language and symbols problem solving and reasoning data management got a descriptive rating of satisfactory however the descriptive rating which the overall descriptive mean rating which is 5.65 means that the level of performance of the students in the four topics in mathematics in the modern world is satisfactory this means that the performance of the students is still on the acceptable level Roman and Villanueva says that mathematics in the modern world is a subject that focuses on the use of mathematics in the natural world. He further stressed that when students perform satisfactorily in this subject, it is reasonable to say that they could apply it in solving real-world problems. I am showing you also the level of difficulty on the various topics covered in mathematics in the modern world. Okay, so from the table, the student respondents exhibited mastery in solving word problems involving Fibonacci sequence, translating mathematical expression or sentence into symbol and vice versa. Applying deductive or deductive reasoning to justify mathematical statements and arguments. However, the students found the following topics to be difficult and moderately difficult, which was the basis in the formulation of the strategic intervention material. These topics are identifying patterns in nature and regularities in the world, translating conditional statement into its converse, inverse and contrapositive solving problems involving patterns and recreational problems applying the different problem solving strategies solving problems involving measures of central tendency measures of relative position and measures of dispersion the following are the conclusions First, the performance of the second year college students in mathematics in the modern world is satisfactory. Second, the students' respondents exhibited mastery in solving word problems involving Fibonacci sequence, translating mathematical expression or sentence into symbol and vice versa, and applying inductive or deductive reasoning to justify mathematical statements and arguments. However, they found the following topics to be difficult and moderately difficult, which was the basis in the formulation of the instructional material. The topics were identifying patterns in nature and regularities in the world, expressing appreciation for mathematics as a human endeavor, translating conditional statement into its converse, inverse, and contrapositive, solving problems involving patterns and recreational problems, applying the different problem-solving strategies, solving problems involving measures of central tendency, measures of relative position, and measures of dispersion. Third, a strategic intervention material addresses the needs of the students in helping them improve their mathematics in the modern world performance. And lastly, the researcher made instructional material is evaluated as very valid and reliable that can help the students develop proficiency in the different learning competencies. So it is composed of four strategic intervention materials with nine lessons. That's the end of my presentation. Thank you very much and God bless us all.